Things are starting to heat up. If you guys haven't been aware about the whole FTX situation, there's a lot of fingers being pointed and some of those fingers are towards Gary Gensler. This right here, this headline says, House GOP to hold hearings focusing on SEC Chair Gensler's role in missing FTX debacle. Now, of course, the question is, could this be the start of a bigger crackdown or what is going to happen from here? Very odd logic. It seems very odd logic to me to sell for a loss after you purchase an equity. Isn't the whole point of owning stocks to buy and hold until the value increases? Why would someone sell at a loss outside of an emergency circumstance? So the short theory just doesn't hold water and the counter is logic. I don't know. I'm just an ape who has listened to one too many books on tape about trading bananas. Now this ape has a good point. If you're buying into an equity and if you've truly done your own DD and if you truly believe in the equity, you're buying into that equity to hopefully have it move up in price in the future. Now you have to ask yourself some questions like how long of a time frame are you looking to hold this equity? Also things like do the fundamentals, does the underlying company still hold? You do have to ask yourself some questions, but yes, in theory, you buy into equities to hold until they increase in value and then you sell them. Some tweets to go through, I don't blame the economy. I blame the hedge funds, I blame the market makers, I blame the politicians, and I blame the Fed. I also blame the banks. Those five things right there, the banks, the Feds, the politicians, the market makers, and hedge funds, the amount of power that they all have, all five of those things have, and the amounts of indirectly or directly they all sort of work with each other, or at least indirectly work with each other, is something to pay attention to. Guys, the Federal Reserve sold at the top of the market. Never forget that. Shorting is a scam, especially naked shorting. Elon Musk tweeted this out a while ago. Check this out, guys. He tweeted this out on January 28th, 2021. He said, you can't sell houses you don't own. You can't sell cars you don't own, but you can sell stock you don't own. This is BS. Shorting is a scam. Legal only for restful reasons. So Elon Musk agrees that shorting a company, especially with shares you don't even own, should be illegal. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think short selling in general should be banned from the markets or do you think it should be just more regulated? Comment down below.